hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be doing a ulta birthday shopping spree where i'm only going to be using my points i've been saving up my points for like over six months now for sure but i have quite a bit of points and i'm really excited because y'all don't know how tempting it's been to just spend those points and i am going to bring my little cousin who's more like my little sister with me so you guys will meet her her name is michelle and yeah that's like my little sister really like we grew up in the same household and everything our moms are super close so that's my sister and when you see her she look like me so that that's really my little sister yeah i'm really excited to go get her and let you guys meet her so i'm gonna go ahead and head over to my cousin house and pick her up and then we're gonna get some lunch because I'm hungry I'm hello hello oh, no. oh. <laughs> I was waiting for you to know I was like wait what's going like, on right. okay let's go oh I like how we both got our hair slicked back well you know you gotta do what you gotta do okay <laughs> Your purse is cute. Well, thank you, Aldo. Aldo. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. My bag is Aldo, too. Oh, stop playing. <laughs> we cute. I look good. You look straight out the 90s. Yes. You know, I try to do a little something. You do a little something, something when you can? Okay. <laughs> what do you usually get from here? Double-double. double-double? Girl, you can't. You barely be eating. What you mean a double-double? I do what I can. Now we finally made it to Ulta. And we got Ross and then Marshalls. I don't know why my camera isn't focusing. But there's also a five below over there, so we might hit that up too. Okay, I'm gonna pass this to you. Meet me by the pool place. Meet me by the pool, guys. It is summertime. Yes. What is this? Oh, look at this pretty color. I don't want no blush stick. But I did want this, this blue eyeliner. Hold on, wait. Kylie's. Look at Kylie's stuff. It's, it's empty. They got a little bit of Kylie skin. Everything is gone. Everything is gone, guys. Those two colors is officially left the building as well. <laughs> I've been eyeballing Jacqueline Cosmetics, but my only issue is I don't know. I don't keep up with the Joneses, so I don't know what we. <laughs> like I don't know. Right, what we're right. Doing. There's so much disrespect going on in the, you know, <laughs> beauty yeah. community. Like, I don't even know what's going on. Like, are we, are we? I don't, I don't know. know. What are we doing? Somebody tell me. Tell me in. Right. I'll be eyeballing her stuff, and I don't be wanting to pick it up, and then end up in a situation where I'm supporting somebody. Else. Right. Supporting exactly. Somebody. I don't know. Like, the high end never excites me. It's the drug <laughs> that packaging is so pretty. It is. Yes, they're very pretty. They always have pretty stuff. I always look at how bright those colors are. I have this color. I need to use it more. I like them. I like that glitter. These colors are pretty. Yeah, those are really pretty. That's honestly, I wanted to get this palette, but as you can see, it's sold out. They're yeah, sold out. <laughs> <laughs> so are these like this is makeup right is this mm -hmm. like for kids no it look like it though huh it's heavy it's eyeshadows it's so cute it is cute. they're heavy i think they're targeting like the younger generation mm -hmm. yeah. oh look at the little oh, birds this. i like that Mine spray and then what is this right. pineapple peach magnifying tasty peach and watermelon yeah, I think I'll try it. Oh, the Aristocats. This used to be my movie when I was little. Yeah, Ari loves that movie. <laughs> she always sing in the song. Oh, look at these palettes. Oh, look at this. Mm -hmm. It's pretty. That's pretty. And it's only $9. And I feel like this draws attention to people. That's why they get these palettes looking like this. Because yeah. it draws attention. Like, they're so pretty. They're look so this. pretty. Very pretty. This is so beautiful. Look at this. So pretty. Look at that color. Very pretty. Yeah. I like straps off. That looks like something I would like. Straps off. Or low cut, actually. This looks really pretty. I'm gonna get low cut. Let's see how I like it. That is a pretty color. Which one do you think is prettier, the top one or the bottom one? Mm, the bottom one. Mm. 
Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. You know, I do not have this palette. I'm going to get it. It's on yes. it. Oh, they have all 15 shades now. Favorite one right here. Opal. It's very pretty. Yes. Michelle, I'm going to get this one for you because I yes. really like it. I'm going to grab this because I never had this before. That's popular. That's pretty bottle. Oh, look. These little bronzes are already sold out. I wanted to try the coffee one, but it's sold out. These are really calm. Love those. I don't have this one. But those colors just don't really interest me. This one, I think you can open. Oh, yeah, you can. Oh, look at those colors. Aren't they beautiful? Those are summer colors right there. Yeah. Very beautiful. Is this one open? Yeah, this one's open. Oh, oh, look at the Los Angeles. That is really pretty. All oh, the shimmery colors. Mm -hmm. That's not really my vibe, but you know. It's, it's very pretty. This bra glue is so bomb. If they had some, I would get it just to have it. We got the Elf Jelly Pop stuff. What is this? Watermelon Ooh, Jelly Pop. I want that. Also, so these glosses. Oh, this one oh, has my. a sparkle. The glitter one is very pretty, guys. That one's glitter. This one's more like a peak clear, but it's very pretty. Look at this. Mmm, that's really pretty. Yes. This is definitely the vibe. It's a vibe, right? It's a vibe. Or is it's that a big palette. palette. It's a really big palette. What is this? Oh, that's... This is a highlighter? That's cute. That is I have cute. nowhere to put that. <laughs> right, it's very big. <laughs> but it's cute. Yeah. The individual this looks so perfect for concealer. The M one seven three. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I've never really known the different sizes of brushes, like how many sizes there are. And they're all it's so amazing. Yeah, you can all use them all for different things. Oh, the Look how chocolate! They are. You can use it as a face palette or as a. Uh, you guys see the, My favorite color is purple, so this is my favorite. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I want this one. Oh, I wonder how that one's going to smell. My basket getting a little, little weight too. Yes. <laughs> oh, I want this. A does. lifting boob serum. But I seen one that was for your butt. Yeah, they but do like, have uh, one. To help your, like, you know, like cellulite and stuff. Mm -hmm. have I've been wanting to get this some stuff This is it, bun, Buns of Glory. Smoothing butt butter, tighten and glow. I love everything that they have, guys. Is Everything is in glass. All of this is glass, by the way. Yeah, like their um, stuff is really, looks really high end, like yes. really tight guys. So I'm just going to show you guys everything that I got today from Ulta. I got a couple things from Marshalls. I did hit a five below and I went to like a little clothing store. I'm I'm going to do Ulta first because I'm not even sure if y'all are interested in all that. So first up, I did grab, which I'm really surprised. I got four Super Shock eyeshadows from ColourPop. I did get rid of all of my ColourPop Super Shock shadows, but when I saw these, I just had to have them. I feel like these colors are just so pretty and I feel like... With all of the neutral palettes that I have, I can always pull one of these for a pop of color or a pop of shimmer. And I feel like my favorite one that I picked up today is this one. It's called Shore Thing. And it's like this really pretty turquoise type of color. Really pretty. I also picked up their cream liner in the shade Crystal Crush. It literally matches my nails so perfect. Like, y'all see that? But... This is what it looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it for you guys. Ooh, that's really pretty. Look at that. So next up, I got the Cabana Club palette from ColourPop. I feel like I went ColourPop crazy, which I was not expecting, but these collections look so beautiful in person. Now that I'm looking at it, this shade right here really does remind me of the Super Shock shadow that I got. This one's a little more green. This one's a little more blue, but this is a really pretty palette. I definitely feel like they should put a mirror in this palette because it was $18. The other 12 pan eyeshadows have a mirror now, so I don't know why this one didn't, but 
this is what this one looks like i feel like this is a colorful palette with pops of neutrals so usually i get neutral palettes with pops of color but if you cover up these shades here then it is a pretty colorful palette so i feel like it's like a really summery type of situation hence Cabana Club, you know. The last thing that I got from ColourPop is their Nude Mood Palette. I've been eyeballing this since it came out and I just never picked it up. I don't know why, but I was like, you know what? Ooh, this look a little, it looks a little broken, but it's, it's fine. This is what it looks like. Now that I'm looking at it, these colors look really light. I kind of feel like I would prefer my other neutral ColourPop palettes over this one because it's so light. So, you know, this was like an impulse buy, but it's okay. It's fine. It's here. And last for eyeshadow palettes, I got the Juvia's Chocolates palette. I've been wanting this for a minute as well. Like, I've been wanting this for a cool, cool minute. I'm pretty sure you guys know what this looks like, but in case you don't, this is the packaging. Those two are the same exact shade. I think am i tripping like comment down below let me know if your chocolates palette has two of the same shades in it or i'm just not sure what happened here and next from juvia's i picked up their bronzer duo is this called a bronzer duo i don't know what it's called it's their bronzer that they just came out with i feel like these colors are so gorgeous like it's very very warm like this one is very very warm this one seems like it will just be a nice flush of bronziness on my face so yeah i'm really happy that i grabbed this okay so next we're gonna get into lippy so first up i have the maybelline lip lifter gloss i have the shade opal so they did bring the five exclusive shades to ulta so if you wanted those you might want to go and head over to ulta to pick up those five exclusive shades that was originally at cvs i thought that was really nice and this was one that i wanted to re-up on so i went ahead and picked this up so i can use up my other one and then I went ahead and picked up the Essence Shine 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 lip gloss. I feel like I've heard so many good things about this and I've never tried it for myself surprisingly as much as I love lip gloss so I had to pick that up. And then oh I think I accidentally grabbed a tester. Look at y'all. I accidentally grabbed a tester so I will have to take this back here, but this is the low cut shade. I'm gonna open it and just show you guys since I have to take it back anyway. This is what it looks like. Really pretty. Um, hopefully when I take it back, they have the actual shade that is unopened because now I'm disgusted that I picked this up. And then I also picked up the Shine Loud Duo thingy in the shade. What shade is this? I don't know what shade this is because it doesn't say, but this is what it looks like. I feel like this would be really pretty with a brown lip liner. And I was really intrigued and I've been hearing good things about this so I wanted to try it out for myself. And last for lippies I picked up the e.l.f. Jelly Pop Luscious Lip Mask in One in a Melon. And I feel like this is going to be so good. I actually want to open this now. It comes with a little applicator. It's really cute. Oh yeah that smells really really good. It smells really really good. Ooh and it looks like don't it just look like something that belongs on your lip like yeah i'm really happy about that and next from the elf jelly pop collection i got the water gel moisturizer this just looked too good to pass up and i also felt like this would smell good so i went ahead and picked it up let's see how it smells oh and it smells so nice and i feel like it's gonna have like that dewy effect on your skin if you like that type of thing i probably will pull from this like later on in the year because it's really hot right now and i don't need dewy vibes i need like super mattifying vibes so yeah i got that and next from iheart revolution i picked up the tasty peach mattifying priming spray i thought this was a setting spray but it's a priming spray that kind of disappoints me a bit i won't lie but i got that the next few things i picked up are brushes so i did grab two brushes from morphe i picked up their m210 brush i feel like this will be good for like packing on eyeshadow or even if you're like doing concealer on your eyebrows and you want to like blend it out a little bit i feel like this will be good for that and then I also picked up the M173 brush because I think this will be a good concealer brush as well. Like if you want to blend out your concealer underneath your eyes or something. So like this will be a really good brush. And then I picked up the e.l.f. Putty Primer Applicator. Yeah, I don't know why I picked this up, honestly. I don't even know why I picked this up because... But it's here and I'm going to use it. I really don't know. I was just grabbing stuff. I was like... It's like... It was like a... 
it was a vibe it felt like a free shopping spree so i was just grabbing stuff so i really don't know i don't know but i'm gonna use it though i'm gonna use it for sure so those are the three brushes i got and next i have two non makeup items like they're the last items that i picked up but they're not makeup so i got the tree hut cotton candy shea sugar scrub y'all this smells so amazing i cannot wait to use this with um cotton candy from um bath and body works oh my god this smells so good but it literally smells like cotton candy and strawberries so i'm really here for that it smells really good and i like that type of vibe and the last thing i picked up is this tangalizer teaser mr spray thingy spray bottle i did have this before and i filled it up with water and then i dropped it and i broke the little knob off of it so it wouldn't work anymore so i went ahead and picked this up because i owed it to myself and i owed it to my daughter to have this because this was really coming in handy when i was using it and i'm really mad that i broke it so i went ahead and picked up another one and i'm glad that i have it back in my life so that is everything that i got from ulta i feel like i got a really good amount of stuff and yeah i'm really happy that i was able to pick up all that stuff and let me grab my receipt so i can tell you guys how much everything was so my total for that Ulta shopping spree that I just had was only, so my total was only $11.86. I don't know if you guys can see that my camera just hasn't been in focus all day. So yeah, that's everything I got from Ulta. And now let's get into what I got from Marshalls. From Marshalls, I only grabbed two things, but I'm going to show you guys anyway. So first up, I grabbed this big old jar of hair scrunchies or hair ties, whatever you guys call them. I call them scrunchies and it's by Ray Dunn. I feel like the jar is really cute. It has butterflies on top. This was only $10.99 and it has how many? 150 hair ties for $10.99 and you get a cute jar. So that's a good deal, right? The next thing I got is this pink frosted animal cracker philosophy body wash. Y'all, it smells so good. And now that I'm thinking about it, I think it will smell really good with this scrub so i'm gonna try those out and i just picked up their i forgot what it's called it's like a pear scent and it has like green sparkles on it i can't remember what it's called but i just picked that one up and i'm obsessed with that so i was really excited to find another philosophy soap so i grabbed that and next we went inside of a clothing store where i didn't grab too much stuff i saw some cute things but i just placed the order at shein so i didn't want to grab too much but i did grab one thing or two things actually so i picked up this tube dress it's like really really long and it has a split it's really cute it was only what 12.99 i feel like the color is really pretty and i think it'll be really pretty to wear on my little birthday trip that i'm going on so i went ahead and picked that up and it's really really soft and i also grabbed some basic gold hoop earrings because i feel like with this dress you need like a little you know hoop earring moment with the hair pulled back so i went ahead and grabbed these and that's really all that i got from this store it's called cozy fox so i don't know i really hope you guys enjoyed shopping with me this is like my pre-birthday shopping spree because I just wanted to do it before my birthday so I could actually use this stuff on my birthday and the days to come for my birthday. And also comment down below and let me know what was your favorite thing that I picked up today. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.